Okay, Ryan, Basecamp Lickers. Ryan, how goes it? Doing pretty well with uh, this uh, new world order. <laughs> I like that expression. It kind of is, right? Yeah, and definitely. Like, um, at Basecamp Lickers, I love Basecamp. I mean, I'm a customer there. I love it. I love the selection. I love the staff. You guys know what you're doing. Uh, I, I enjoy going into the store. Um, and you guys really got Thank out. And, uh, for sure. You guys kind of got out ahead of this whole thing in terms of being safe and safety. And I'd like for you to tell me a little bit more about that, including what happens if I just want to walk in the store and go buy a bottle of wine. I can still do that. Yeah, definitely. Um, kind of a weird thing. I went uh, with Chevy Ricchini, another – Summit County local. We uh, we went to Japan like two months before this all hit and kind of saw it coming. So when we came back, we started putting protocols in place and getting sanitizers and cleaning the store a little bit more. And it really put us in a good position to uh, to try to see what was coming. I mean, there's this this came like a tidal wave. So right. everybody was scrambling. But we uh, we sanitized the store. We sanitized all the uh, credit card machines. Um, and we've been really focused on trying to keep the doors open to our customers, but in a safe, responsible way. Not only for them, but also for, for our employees who've been the, really the rock stars through this whole thing. No, Ryan, I love that. Because again, I love going into the store. I want to look around a little bit. I want to pick something out. But I do want to be safe. I'm a little bit worried about things like everyone else is. So the fact that you guys are sanitizing, cleaning things. I know your staff's wearing masks now. That's yep. just a smart thing to do, right? And uh, that social distance piece, I mean, it kind of contradicts that customer service element of it. But yeah. It's that safe piece and spending the time that we can with our customers, but letting them kind of do things on our own is really important. But we also have that extra measure where we have that curbside delivery uh, that we've really yeah. been working I'm on. I'm excited to talk about that. So I can go to your website, order anything I want on there. And I love this. It's not ready in a couple of days or next week or at the end of the month. It's ready in maybe 10 minutes. Is that right? Yeah, we kind of have a challenge with uh, with each other of who can get the orders together quicker. You know, in the morning, we have a bunch of orders that we do, so it might take like 15, 20 minutes. But uh, you go to the website, You uh, our whole inventory is online. You can order whatever you want. Um, we get that order, we put it together, then we call you to confirm exactly what you want, that we had it. Um, if you want to make any changes, then we take the payment then. So you're not paying online and uh, and we just do it right then and there. And then when you can when you're I, ready. I love that too, Ryan, because I know I've ordered online sometimes and I pay right then and there, but then they call me back two days later and say, oh, we actually didn't have that product. Now we owe you a refund. I'm like, ah, oh, what a disaster. So you guys confirm the order, call me back and say, hey, we have everything or we were missing one thing. Here's your grand total, pay right over the phone. Exactly. So we, we pick it and we know exactly what you have. And then if there's something different, we try to work with you and, and, and fill that void. Um, and then when you're ready to, 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 to get your order, you just pull literally right up in front in that fire lane right in front of the store. You call us, we'll walk it right out to you. We'll open the door or you have the back open or whatever you need. We'll look at your ID. I, I, can park in in fire, I can park in the fire lane for the first time? Right? Uh, it's, it's a very short term. <laughs> the parking lots aren't very busy right now. I'll put it that way. <laughs> I love it. And I love what you said earlier too that, um, hey, if we're at home, we're cooking dinner and we need one bottle of wine, which sometimes happens. I know my wife the other day was like, man, I need some Chardonnay. Um, there, there's no minimum. So I can order one bottle of wine on your website, race down, pick it up, good to go. Yeah, I mean, this is this is for everybody. This is like, you know, we look at this as community help in the community. Okay. Um, and so it could be four cases of wine. It could be one bottle of wine. Um, it's it's for the everyday person. There's no fee. There's no extra charge. Um, we're, we're happy to do it. I mean, it's it's this change, and you have to change with what's going on, and, yep. and that's what we want to do and make it as convenient as possible. I mean, we have some very elderly people customers we don't want them having to come to the store or people that are that right. have pre-existing conditions we want to make it safe keep and it. easy for everybody safe. okay we'll keep up the good work pop into the store base camp liquors awesome location right in frisco love it my favorite liquor store and if you want to order online boom even better hit it up base camp liquors right yeah basecamplickers.com thank you very much have a great day guy be safe okay. be safe